Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis coming to you from beautiful Salem. And tonight, I have a comment rather than a question. And this is based on something that our own Marianne Kay has frequently remarked upon. And that is the idea of reality bigots. And what does this mean? It's a term that Marianne coined for a phenomenon that we see a great deal of in the metaphysical community, and one that I thought I should remark upon. And that is, you know, when we who are in the metaphysical community, almost all of us, uh, well, literally all of us, have one or more unusual beliefs that we hold dear. We believe in things that people in the wider society often do not believe in. Sometimes we believe in a lot of things they don't believe in, sometimes only a few. You would think that the experience of believing in things that are not necessarily shared widely and are sometimes made fun of by wider society would make us very tolerant. But oddly enough, this is not what we see. What we see is that a lot of people in our community demand tolerance for their particular point of view, but have no tolerance for any other. And uh, of late, I've seen quite a bit of this online. And I've seen it in our comment section here at Magic TV. I've seen it other places. It's certainly nothing new. Uh, but I don't think it's a good idea for our community. Um, I think that it's very important for we who do believe in the unseen world, who believe in various things that the wider society often does not, to remember that we ask them to open their minds to the idea that things are not always as they seem, and that things are possible that are undreamt of in their philosophy. And that, bearing this in mind, we should be equally open-minded ourselves. And when we hear of an idea that is different from our own, instead of rejecting it immediately, we should always be open to the possibility that there might be something to it. And sometimes we'll find that there is, sometimes we'll find that there isn't, uh, but certainly for the person who holds that point of view, there must be something to it or they would not hold it. It must serve some positive function for them, and it behooves us to bear this in mind. I think that the biggest problem facing the metaphysical community is intolerance within our own metaphysical community, not the intolerance of the wider society. And it's something that we must overcome if we're to have any chance of standing together on the important issues of the day. So those are my thoughts for tonight. I hope you find them interesting and helpful. And until next time, may you blessed be. Hi, I'm Terry the Stone Lady. For all your crystal and stone needs, come to witchschoolstore.com.